Hello, my name is Sue Johnson and I'm here with my husband Jim to tell you a little bit about our son Kyle, who took his own life three years ago at the age of 19 while he was a sophomore in college. Kyle was a special soul with a special heart, known for his love of family and friends. Kyle had a passion for helping others and making people feel happy. He had a devotion to volunteering in the special needs community because making everyone feel included and special made Kyle feel the best. Although his life was far too short, Kyle's legacy of caring for others no matter how he was feeling himself remains with us today. It is why we have created a nonprofit organization, Kyle Cares, in his memory. Since 2019, Kyle Cares has been dedicated to eliminating student self-harm and suicide by teens and young adults. As suicide is now the second leading cause of death in the United States for young adults between the ages of 14 and 24. We do this by assisting New England high schools and colleges to create environments and school cultures that enable students who might be struggling with mental health to seek help without shame or without hesitation. In two years, we have worked with our strategic partners to provide nearly $100,000 in funding for over 65 mental health awareness workshops, training, and programs that have impacted thousands of students, faculty, and parents. This work is needed now more than ever. Mental illnesses such as anxiety, depression, and suicide were already rising at alarming rates before COVID-19, and the pandemic's impact on student mental health has led to an even greater need for mental health services. As we support this mental health awareness campaign by the Mental Health Collaborative, we share these words written by Kyle in a final letter he left for us. You should try and be nice to everyone. I know it's hard, but everyone has a story that will break your heart. Be good to everyone because you never know what someone is going through. Thank you.